share with you the gospel. But before I share the good news, I'm going to have to share the bad news. The bad news is that we've all fallen short of the glory of God. And His wrath is being revealed to all those who suppress the truth by their unrighteousness. That though they know Him, they did not honor Him as God. But in their, in their thinking, their thoughts became futile. So, in the book of Proverbs, we're told to open up our mouth for the like mute, for the no, right, for no, all we can who talk are destitute. Here. You to open your mouth, okay, judge talk. righteously, well, defend he's done the preaching. rights of the poor and needy. And who are the poor and can needy? Can you tell your employees to get out who, from in front of us? Who yeah, you are can these talk children but the most innocent, the most mute, the most poor, the more, most needy? We ought to speak up for those who don't have a voice. We are commanded in God's word not to murder. And, and I hope you don't think I'm yelling. I'm just speaking up to talk over the hecklers and so those that are in there might hear us. Hey, John. Uh, this is a guy who called our pastor about a year ago. He didn't come talk to me. He just called my pastor. He yep. never apologized. So, like I was saying, there, there, there is a way that seems okay. right unto a man, but it's and now ways you got your the employees end of death. In front of us. And, and, and all of us can testify to that. We're not and looking then, for this. Like they're here. That's why I'm. Well, I'm thank you. To I talk to them. It, it was a little bit easier than I thought. Okay. Get them out of our area. All right. Now we can get into the word. <laughs> Move faster than I thought. 